Hello, Libra. And Cross Watchers. Thank you guys so much for joining in. Welcome to Natural Healing Tarot. My name is Nina. I am the reader here on the channel. I just want to make an announcement really quick. I finally got my Vimeo together. So we are going to start doing extended readings, even though these weeklies I'm going to do just the whole reading right here on YouTube. I will probably upload these videos on Vimeo as well, but I am going to link that in the description box. If it's something you're interested in, check it out. Um, if you want any of the extended readings, it's going to be linked in the description box. Um, and uploaded to Vimeo. So thank you guys so much for the support in that. Um, I had to get the money together um, to pay. I wanted to pay for a year subscription so it didn't cost more money. Today we are going to take a look at your week ahead, Libra, for November 17th through the 23rd. If you would like to get entered into the drawing that I do every month for a free personal reading, all you have to do is comment your astrological sign below, but it is helpful if you subscribe to the channel um, so you can be notified when I upload the video when the winners are announced. So let's see here. Please keep in mind the messages on YouTube are general. They're not going to resonate every time with every person. Feel free to check other signs within your astrological chart. Um, really, it's about the title. If the title resonates, there's probably something in the message for you. If you would like me to dig deeper into your personal situation, I do still offer personal readings. However, I'm not going to be offering personal readings after the beginning of the year. Um, I really just want to focus on these general readings and getting general messages out to the public. I will, however, still be offering the free personal readings every month. So get your chance to win that. So let's see here, Libra. We have no place like home, but it is in the reverse and um, serendipity. So I feel like there's a need to work on your confidence. I feel like there's a need to trust that everything is going to be taken care of, trust that everything happens for a reason. I feel like you may be looking at a situation like focus too much on one particular outcome and there is a need to be a little bit more flexible, a little bit more open. So let's see here. Do feel like um, there is some important changes to come as soon as you can change your perspective. Build your confidence back up enough to know and to trust that everything that happens for a reason and everything will be taken care of for you. So let's see. We are going to do this weekly a little bit different. If you haven't been able to tell, we are going to, I'm going to look at the overview message. We're going to pull a couple cards for overview. And then with the second deck, I'm going to go in and do each day of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, into the weekend. So let's see. Overview for this week, Libra. What can you expect? And I'm going to get clarification on each of these cards. The next card out is what's working in your favor. Okay. 
What's not working is I feel like you're going to be walking away or you're, there's a lot of sadness um, also with the devil energy here of what's not working in your favor there is definitely a karmic lesson that needs to be learned within all of this and I feel like it has a lot to do with self-care self um, healing self self-confidence building yourself back up I feel like this situation is very burdening to you. Um, it's a lot of stress, a lot of anxiety, a lot of lower vibration. But there is definitely something that needs to be learned within this situation and I knew it. The Empress just came out. This card is nurturing, loving, mother-like, right? But it also symbolizes self-care, self-nurturing, self-healing. I feel like there's a situation from the past that you feel tied to, but you also feel very burdened. Maybe by your current situation, um, I do feel like something has recently changed. Maybe something has recently ended. I also feel like this person, they may be looking at the situation more of like a friendly type of situation still, and you have a different vision, okay? There's going to be a new opportunity. Now, this could be a new offer a new person a new offer this also could mean reconciliation or a new chance to get it right with this past person let me pull one more card from that other deck really quick before we start working on the days of the week for this new opportunity. So can I get some clarification, Spirit, for Libra on this new opportunity? Is this a new person? Maybe a new person. It's most likely a new person that may even align better with what you had envisioned, more traditional type of um, relationship more suiting for you, more balanced. So let's see here. I do the no place like home in reverse. It symbolizes um, a need to walk away from a situation and not wanting to see that it's time to go. And I do feel like that's what that's what this is all about. It's really about teaching people how to treat you and expressing what it is that you truly want. And if you've expressed to this person how you want this situation to turn out or you would like more communication, and they haven't followed through with that, you have to make a decision to walk away. When love is no longer being served, we have to love ourselves enough to walk away. Ultimately, Libra, the lesson I feel that me is being taught here by the universe is self-love, self-care. So let's get into it here. Most important message for Libra. We're going to look at Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then the weekend. 
So let's see here, Libra. I really get the sense here and we will see when the cards come out for the week, but I feel like there's going to be a situation presented to you throughout this week for the energy that I'm picking up that you're going to find, you're going to somehow figure it out intuitively or maybe even just a message or a conversation you're going to realize that it's time to love yourself enough to let this go and focus on what's best for Libra. Mm -hmm. This is for Monday. So the hangman in reverse is, is done waiting. That's what that symbolizes. You're done waiting, and this is going to bring in balance and wish fulfillment. I feel like it's going to open you up to this new person coming in. On Monday... They're very well, that's when that conversation may happen I, or you just wake up like I can't wait no more. Um, but there is no more waiting. No more waiting. I feel like that's you feel intuitively this is the right path for you. Now, Tuesday comes along, you're working on yourself, you're focusing on releasing, letting go. Okay, right? Letting these walls down, putting your guard down. Work with the Nine of Pentacles. Now, on Wednesday, we have the Five of Pentacles and the High Priestess. This tells me that there may be a situation where this person comes back feeling abandoned, feeling left in the cold, and you are just done. You may have even thought this was a soulmate connection and this very well could be a soulmate connection, but understanding what a soulmate really is, um, isn't really the same thing as a life partner, isn't the same thing as a forever person, a best friend. I do feel like you are going to be accepting this situation fully when Thursday, by the time Thursday comes around. I do feel here, Libra, that this is a process of acceptance. And with the strength coming, the strength card coming out, that kind of confirms what I, what I'm already feeling. But this, you're going through a process of acceptance. You're going through a process of healing from this situation. I feel like by Friday, you can't hold it in any longer. You There's definitely a conversation that's had. Um, but understand that... I feel like this process that you're going through is brick by brick taking a weight off of your shoulders. I also feel there may be a fire sign that's coming back, uh, coming back in or coming in that's going to be helping you heal from this situation. We have double world cards, okay? So, completion of a cycle, it also symbolizes a higher level of knowing higher level of perception.
A lot of people reference to the world card as an ending. And it does mean like the completion of a cycle, but it symbolizes learning the lessons that you needed to learn. Being in this higher level of understanding because of what you've gone through. Um, I do feel like there were a lot of things that you learned from this person, from this situation, from going through this. Um, and so understand that everything happens for a reason. Again, it comes back to everything happens for a reason. So Libra. I'm feeling like you got a pretty good solid message. Let's get some guidance cards out here to sum it up. Um, and get some. This is the goddess guidance deck, just for those of you that wanted to know. Mm -hmm. I do get the sense that you have the inner wisdom. You are being guided in what direction to take, what path. There's going to be a golden opportunity, but you're going to have to get crystal clear. Focus your intentions. Okay? So Libra, that is the message that I have for you guys. Thank you so much for all your love and support. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. If you are interested in information on how to book a personal reading, how to contact me for business inquiries, um, my Vimeo account, all that information is linked below in the description. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. And I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.